But six, the Humane Society of Tulsa picked up five dogs rescued from a dog meat farm in South Korea. Two works you anchor Shara Kimiko tells us what she uncovered. Oh, you know what? This, these dogs were living in absolutely devastating conditions and they were destined for slaughter. But the Humane Society International stepped in and they saved 170 dogs. The Humane Society of Tulsa took five of them and now will take in another 19 dogs next month. Workers at the Humane Society say they are now dedicating all the time to the rehabilitation of these dogs, providing the best medical care possible. The goal is to make sure that these dogs are ready for new homes when they are put up for adoption in a few weeks. Every time we do one of these large scale rescues, no matter how horrible the situation is, the best part, the absolute best part of it is seeing these animals come from a shutdown situation or a really bad situation to going home with a fabulous family. Now, even though the South Korean government has outlawed meat farms last year, the Humane Society International has actually shut down six of the farms all across South Korea. You can help the animals by donating. The biggest need is pedigree wet and dry food for the adult dogs, as well as blankets and beds. Also, the Humane Society of Tulsa is requesting monetary donations for medical care and rehabilitation. Uh, so those donations can be ma made online at TulsaPets.com or, of course, the Adoption Center. The dogs, they would love to have a home. So when they are ready, go ahead and check out their website. Back to you, Brian. Uh,